it's a rainy day, a good day to meditate. Of course, every day is a good day to meditate, but when it's raining outside, your attention naturally turns inward. You'll be inside most of the day. And sort of try to be inside your body, too. Stay with the sense of the breath. Get a nice blanket, wrap yourself up, and just look inside. Try to be very observant. The Buddha said there are three qualities that are important for making progress in the practice. One is being truthful. In other words, being really true to yourself about what you do. And the second is being observant, noticing what you're doing and the results that you're getting. These two qualities go together. The more truthful you are about things, the more observant you're going to be. And then the third quality is not just resting content with what you've got. We hear the Buddha say a lot about contentment, but that has mainly to do with your physical circumstances. Okay, it's raining today, so you don't think about how nice it would be not to rain. We need the rain. The trees need the rain. People need the rain. So whether your mood is in the mood for rain or not, that doesn't matter. You put that aside. You're content with the fact that it's raining today, and you make the most of it. As for discontent, the Buddha said, if you see that the mind could do better than it's doing, well, try to do better. Don't just say, well, this is good enough for right now, because who knows how much right now you've got. You've got the opportunity now to move forward. We say, well, this is good enough for now, because we think, well, there will be time in the future where I can push forward. But when is, if pushing forward is always put off into the future, it's never going to happen. The pushing forward has to be right now. So if it's a matter of getting the mind more quiet or trying to be a little bit more sharp in your insights, sharp in your perception of what's going on, whatever needs to be done, here's some time to do it. The time is right now. If you've got these three qualities, you're truthful, you're observant, and you're not content to just rest where you are, then your practice is sure to progress.